My name's Garrett. Um, I found Roanoke by chance, actually. I was driving down the interstate and got a flat tire and had a, had a free day in my college search. And so we stopped by Roanoke and I fell in love with it and now I'm here. I came to Roanoke knowing that environmental science was what I wanted, but what I didn't realize was that the support of professors and advisors would encourage me to explore beyond my comfort zone into new areas that I was unaware of. It wasn't until the end of my sophomore year at Roanoke that I narrowed down the options for after Roanoke. I took a May term course called It Could Happen to Us and it really opened my eyes to the field of infectious diseases. I had already signed up for summer research with Dr. Lassiter, a professor in the biology department. Together we formulated an idea for a research project that combined his interests and mine. We came up with a plan to look at estrogen levels in the river and see if they are different above and below the Roanoke wastewater treatment plant. The research has opened many doors I never imagined possible. I presented at conferences and sessions which have made me more appealing to graduate schools. The final piece of the puzzle for me, now that I knew I wanted something in public health, was to figure out where I wanted to go to graduate school. Last semester I went to the University of East Anglia in England. I was lucky enough to do that. And while I was there I fell in love with the people and the culture and just their whole way of life over there and decided that's where I wanted to continue my education. And so I applied to the University of Edinburgh in Scotland. Uh, got in five weeks later and one, I think one of the big reasons I got in was uh, Roanoke's commitment to research and liberal art based um, curriculum. But my time at Roanoke hasn't been all work and no fun. I'm a proud member of Pi Kappa Phi fraternity, one of four on campus, and have been extremely active in Student Government Association and Earthbound, the environmental group on campus. I also participated in Journey, a freshman outdoor orientation program, which really started my college experience on a great note. Through these groups, I've made close friends and found my place at Roanoke. College is tough and prepares you for the real world. You might face setbacks. The college chaplain, Paul, helped me through some of these hard times. So just learn from your mistakes and allow yourself to be open to new ideas and thoughts, and you'll have the best time of your life here.